Welcome, Cancers. I'm back. I'm back. I'm back. Click the like button and share with your family and friends on the way in. We're going to get down to it. Like, let's get down to it. I'm trying to see what energy I feel for you guys. This is going into the month of July. Okay, July. Well, from here until July. From now up until July. Because we're still in June right now. So let's see. If this message, message resonates with you guys, leave me a thumbs up. Comment below. As well as share with your family and friends if you want to book your very own personal reading. That information is in the drop box below. If you want to donate to my channel, um, that information is in the drop box below. Okay, so we got soulmate. All right. Hmm. Soulmate. Wow. Okay. Soulmate. Oh, we got union. Divine timing. In due time, your soulmate. Your. Ooh. Somebody's afraid here. We got fear. Somebody is afraid because they have to do the shadow work. Somebody's afraid to do. <laughs> Somebody's afraid to do the dark work. Somebody's afraid to dig deep into their, you know, fears. Fear is, you know, dark energy. Okay. Somebody is afraid. And then we got the answer is yes. Big dreams. Ooh. Ooh. All right, so let's let's see. I feel like someone here is dealing with a soulmate, okay, or is looking for their soulmate, um, or is ready for their soulmate, calling in their soulmate. But some of y'all are afraid to do the work. Some of y'all are afraid to get your hands dirty. Some of y'all think that it's just gonna fall from out the air. Some of y'all just like, what's going on here? Okay, wow. All right, so I'm going to keep these. We're going to move these to the side. I like. Like, like, like. Y'all go ahead and hit that like button. This is about to get real interesting. Very interesting. Ooh, okay. We got unrequited love, okay? So maybe you feel as if there's not enough chemistry or attraction to keep this relationship going or things just aren't even. Okay, it's not an even exchange. It's not an equal give and take, okay? Or some of you are just unsure. Some of you are unsure if this person is your true love. Some of you feel like you you feel like you deserve more or deserve some you know exactly what it is that you deserve. So you possibly aren't sure if this person is your soulmate. You may feel like this person is afraid to do the work, okay? or vice versa is it safe for you it is safe for you to love okay it is safe for you to love okay now let's look at this together let's look at this together some of you may need to release an ex okay you're separated from someone an ex that you possibly haven't fully let go of some of you need to release an ex okay in order to call in your soulmate. I feel like you aren't sure if this person is your soulmate, okay? Because you're not sure if you guys are on the same page, if you guys are, you know, even together on the same note. Give me one second. Give me one second. All right, so some of you are just uncertain if this person is, you know, a good pick or good match for you. I feel like you and this person, some of you may be dealing with um, dealing with whether or not if this is the best that you can do. If you could do better, if you can find somebody better, if you can find a better match. Because I got soulmate and I got union here. But somebody is afraid. They're afraid to let their guard down or afraid 
um, if they open up their heart, are is is they're going to you know going to regret it? That's the type of energy that I'm getting here. Okay, with unrequited love, I got the six of wands and the four of wands. Okay, so I feel like there's success in regards to stability and home life or even possibly like a marriage. Um, I'm getting like, okay, three of swords. <clears throat> Maybe there's third party energy or someone is still holding on to some type of pain. Um... Why is the Three of Swords here? Or someone uh, does things for attention. I'm getting a wound. Somebody's heartbroken. Um, and, or someone does things for attention. Um, I'm getting that somebody is wounded. Like their heart is really like hurting. And this is past energy. So maybe you felt like this person was your soulmate. But you found out that things just were wasn't that this just wasn't a balance i'm getting like somebody was definitely hurt here with the three of swords and the nine of wands somebody is definitely hurt here okay for present energy we got union and true love okay so presently i feel like okay we got knight of wands okay so it looks like there's um you know you guys may just be on some player some player stuff right now okay you possibly have gotten a new outlook. Some of you are talking about a divorce and wanting something new. We got the Hierophant and the Ten of Swords here. Okay, why is the Knight of Wands here? Oh, the Devil, Capricorn Energy, and the Six of Swords. Okay, so I'm getting like maybe some of you guys travel back and forth to see this person. I'm seeing a lot of traveling, like back and forth, like little quick trips back and forth. But I got the devil here, and I got the knight of pentacles at the bottom of the deck, which is Capricorn's energy. Okay, why is the devil here? Page of cups reverse and eight of wands. Yeah, somebody's saying that they're in a relationship, but the relationship is possibly toxic. Um, is it safe to love? We got, yes, with the Ace of Wands, okay? I see somebody is really thinking about, like, their heart being broken and being left out in the cold. Like, them being the one that's ending up hurt, okay? Um, or someone is really, really loving that D or that P. <laughs> yeah. Someone is also getting ready to get a new car. <laughs> that just came out. Someone is getting ready to get a new car. Stop giving uh, someone something is what I'm getting to. There may be a cutoff in communication and something is better off. But somebody is getting, some, getting ready. You guys are getting ready to get some good news. I got the Knight of Cups and the Sun card. You guys are getting ready to get some, new, some good news. Okay. Um, and some of you may just be deciding to keep your options open because you're waiting on some good news coming. But I feel like you guys are dealing, either you're dealing with someone that's afraid to let their guard down completely or you're afraid to let your guard down completely. I feel like you really do have feelings for this person, but you're just not sure if this person feels the same way. Um, you're not, you're possibly looking at their actions and you know, you're just not sure. If you're not sure, okay, you just... Yeah, you're not completely 100% sure. What message is there for Cancers? I got the Knight of Cups. Okay. Romeo, Juliet, Knight of Cups, and the Chariot card. You guys, is energy. Okay. Eight of Cups. Someone's asking someone if they're leaving. You possibly are asking someone, are they leaving? Or someone is asking you, are you leaving? Or asking where you're going? We got the lovers. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. 
you may be waiting for this person to tell you how they feel. King of Wands reverse could be Leo, Sagittarius, Aries energy. And I got the Hierophant. Okay. Ace of Pentacles. You're waiting on an opportunity or you're waiting on something new from this person. I feel like some of y'all want to give up, but you're waiting for this person to show you something. To offer you something that is tangible or something that is beneficial to you. Why is the Knight of Cups here? King of Pentacles. So is someone asking you for money? Is someone asking you for um asking you for something? Or some of you are dealing with the uh um Virgo Taurus Capricorn or someone who is very financially secure. Okay. Are you trying to get somebody to sympathize with you? Let's see, why is the lovers here? Ooh, the lovers and the empress and the three of cups. Is there third party energy here? Or are you guys telling someone that you're leaving because there's third party energy? Eight of cups. Okay, someone's not telling the truth. Someone's not telling why they left or if they want to leave, okay? Something about telling the truth. Why is the ace of swords here reversed? Why is the ace of swords reversed? We got the devil. Some of y'all are dealing with a Capricorn or the situation is just toxic. Look, someone here is stuck in their ego, in their ways here. And why is the chariot card here? Which is you guys' this energy. Yeah, page of pentacles. So someone is asking you if there's someone else. Possibly that's what's going on. Someone is asking you, is there someone else or vice versa? Um, someone is possibly saying that they're going to leave if they don't get the truth. Um, I think someone wants to find out if there is a third party energy. Why is the king of wands here in reverse? Some of you are dealing with um, a Leo, a Sagittarius, or an Aries. Okay. King of wands reverse. He's very passionate, very sexual very hot and steamy type of energy so the that part may be really really good in you guys' relationship some of you guys are waiting to take action okay until you find out the truth why is the seven of pentacles here then it's in the reverse so you're you're becoming impatient like you're ready to take action you was ready to take action in the past yeah tennisaurus you may feel like the situation wasn't worth it Okay, so maybe some of you are deciding to leave because you feel like the situation is not worth it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Maybe you were trying to make a profit off of something, um, but it just wasn't working out in your favor. So now we got the higher friend going into the near future. Okay. I see that there's some type of temporary agreement. Um There's some type of temporary agreement. Why is the Knight of Wands here? Yeah. Okay. See, I'm getting a lot of sexual energy here. I'm, I'm seeing a lot of sex, a lot of sex in, in the near future. Okay. But it's like an agreement of some sort. Someone here has been keeping their emotions. I'm getting like just a, a, a sexual, uh, a sexual um, partnership. And someone keeping their feelings tucked. Kaysen, I'm doing a video, baby. So you're going to have to go in the room and sit quietly until I'm done. Okay? Somebody here is keeping their feelings and their emotions. They're hiding that because they're trying to keep this energy here. Like, you know, we just friends or we just doing this. We're just doing that. Let's just keep our emotions Okay. Huh. Huh. So is that why you're not sure if this person is your soulmate? You're not sure if this is what if this is what a soulmate is? <laughs> why is the three of cups and the empress here and the lovers? Why is the three of cups here? King of Swords reverse. Yikes. 
Okay, so maybe you wanted to cut somebody off. You wanted to cut this person off. King of Swords reverse. Okay. And the Knight of Swords reverse. Ooh, 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 ooh. And look at you. You maybe some of you um, didn't listen to your intuition. Okay, or you're trying to figure out something. Um, you're trying to figure something out. And I feel like some of you are trying to figure out is there a third person involved? Um, is there someone on the side with the Knight of Wands and the Sun card? Is somebody on the side is what I'm getting. I feel like you guys, if you don't find out the truth, you're willing to walk away because you feel like the situation could be toxic. Um, and as if some of you already haven't walked away, I feel like some of you have already walked away in anything because you feel like it's not worth it. Something was not worth it here. Why is the Ten of Swords here? Yeah. You want to have this, you want to make this even. You want this to be a balanced out thing. You want to make amends, make this even. Um... Why is the justice card here? You want to make this fair. Yeah, because you feel like you can find better or you can do better. Mm-hmm. I feel like there's disagreements and... Um, this situation got kind of burdensome for you. So some of you already walked away. But then I'm getting this big player energy in the near future. But it's like a mutual agreement. It's like a mutual thing is what I'm getting here. All right. So What message is, is there for cancer? We got success. Something is going to be very successful. Only if you communicate clearly what it is that you want. Okay. So this can be success for you. Success is on the horizon for you. But you're going to have to communicate clearly what it is that you want. Okay. Yeah. So you're going to be able to come to a peaceful resolution. Yes. And then look at this. Yes. At the bottom of the deck. You're going to be able to come to a peaceful resolution. Once you decide that you're going to communicate clearly to this person exactly what it is that you want or they're going to communicate to you clearly what it is that they want. And I feel like there's success, like there's success here. Nine of Pentacles, yeah. I feel like there's success here. Okay, I'm getting that. There's an offer, okay? There's an offer on the table. Somebody's going to be giving someone something, giving someone some advice or giving someone something, um, actually giving someone something. I got the King of Cups, the King of Swords, and the Three of Cups. Somebody does not want to just be friends here. Somebody does not, someone, someone here wants more than to just be friends. I'm getting communicate clearly. Emperor. Yeah, take control. Okay, yeah. Page of Pentacles. Speak exactly what it is that you want. Call your power back. Knight of Wands. Leo, Sagittarius, Aries, Energy. Some of you guys are dealing with fire signs, okay? Somebody keeps coming back. Okay, like somebody keeps coming back and forth, like... They don't leave for long. They they run off and then they come back. Yeah, the lovers. This could be a situationship, a temporary thing here. Okay, Knight of Wands and the lovers. This could most definitely be like a friends with benefits, a situationship. Um, I'm getting that, you know, if that's what it is, that's what it is. Somebody feels like they tried everything. Somebody feels like they tried everything. Like, I've tried everything. And it's like, what are we going to do? I don't want to lose you. You don't want to lose me. And I feel like you guys are going to be able to come to some type of peaceful resolution. Okay, well, we got the two of swords. So, you guys may decide that you aren't done with each other. You don't want to be finished with each other. 
okay so you guys may decide that you don't want to be together in a relationship some some of you may decide to move on i do sense that there could possibly be a breakup with the three of swords and the six of swords so some of you may decide that you don't want a relationship with this person or vice versa some someone may be upset because something didn't go in their favor And I got the judgment card. Someone is saying, stop judging me. Queen of Cups and the Sun. You guys, it's energy. And the Sun. Okay. I'm getting that there is like a big awakening. Okay. You may be getting ready to find out a lot about this person. This person may be getting ready to find out a lot about you and how you think and how you do things. But I do feel like a peaceful resolution is going to be on the table. Okay. I feel like there is going to be a, a, a conversation that is going to be had. Um, and it may revolve around whether or not someone feels if they can trust um, the other person or not. If this person is safe, is it safe for this person to let their guard down? Okay. Is it okay for this person to open up their heart? You could be asking them that or they can be asking you that. Okay. Um, but someone's uncertain. Okay, someone's unsure if they want a relationship. Someone's unsure if they want to be, you know, exclusive. Because I'm getting a lot of, you know, temporary energy, like boo thing type energy. All right, so that's going to be the message that I have for you guys. Oh, uh, let me get one more before I leave. Let me um, get a message from here. What message is there for cancers? Thank you. I got starseed. What lights you up? What lights you up? All right. It's time for some of y'all. It's time to take a break. Okay. It's time to get some deep replenishment. Be held. Retreat and rest. Okay. For some of you, it's time to give the situation a break. Like the situation needs... A, a time out somebody needs to uh yeah see somebody here needs to get grounded first somebody in this situation isn't grounded enough or isn't mature enough to handle the situation like an adult so you know someone definitely needs to take a break here all right my loves if you want to book your very own personal reading information is below i am running a special so right now it's up great time to book your very own personal reading all right information is in the drop box below share subscribe and um, comment below guys all right until next time